you guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to another video for today's video we are doing another one of our chatty get ready with me's and today's topic is self confidence i asked you all on my community poll as well as on my instagram that what is it that stops you from being the best version of yourself what are your hidden insecurities and your obstacles and things that just don't allow you to grow and so many of you all responded to that with all your personal problems your obstacles insecurities which i completely relate to on a lot of levels so i'm a very keen observer i have a habit to observe everything that goes on around me and within me as well and i try to learn from everything that goes on not just in my life but also in other people's life so taking all of that with me we are going to talk about body image issues social anxiety communication problems and toxicity in and around you in your family at home within friend circles failures and a lot more talking about personal issues and how you can come out of it is the major agenda of today's video it's going to be a long chatty one but i'm sure is going to help you in a lot of ways so don't forget to go grab your cold coffee or your iced tea or some snack and let's dive straight into this but before that if this is the first time you've come here then hi i'm sara i make beauty and lifestyle content here on youtube so if this is the first time you've come here take a moment and hit the subscribe button join the sara squad i'm sure you'll have a great time here and also don't forget to hit the bell icon right next to it so that every time i upload a video you get notified and with that let's dive straight into this all right so let's get started i want to do something very simple and fresh Uh, when it comes to my base makeup, and somebody actually commented on my community post and told me, "Okay, why don't you do a red lip when you're doing the get ready with me?" Because I know it's been a while that I've done a red lip look, and red lip is my signature look, you guys. So I will do a red lip today. So we'll keep the rest of the makeup very simple and fresh, very summer friendly. All the details for the makeup I will mention in the description box because we'll chat as we go along in the video. First, let's start with skin prep. I've gone ahead and cleansed my face. I've used my Dermaviv Hydra Cleanser for that. It's a great way to just cleanse and start with a fresh canvas it will take away all the dirt the makeup and the residue on your face and then next i'm going in with a nutriderm vitamin e moisturizing lotion we'll first start with skin prep so that you know our base just stays longer and stays fresh for a longer period of time and this moisturizer is great for a pre makeup base It's just great in general. I use it twice a day, every single day, and it's the only moisturizer I have currently, and it works magic for my skin. Once I've pressed this nicely into my skin and my skin is soaking it all in, I'll go next with my primer, and I'm using the Inside Cosmetics primer. And let's start with our first question that we have was is it okay to hide your insecurities and live with them all your life so i think insecurities are something you can never completely get rid of it's a journey it's never a destination it's not a one stop solution aisa nahi hota hai ki humko koi cheez ki matlab aadat nahi hai ya we don't like something about ourselves and kal ko main matlab kisi ko bolu ki theek hai na to tu moti hai to kya hua aise hi hota hai and she'll change the way she thinks about herself like i would not judge her for that but if she's insecure about her body weight she's not going to change that thought overnight it's going to be a journey it's going to be something that she might not ever get rid of it's this insecurity that she might live with all her life or it's something that she will work on every day so insecurities are so personal that you have to make a decision for yourself that do you want to live with it all your life because you living with an insecurity will mean ke tumko kabhi bhi wo cheez ke bare mein koi bhi bura lagwa sakta hai matlab wo chahe aapka body weight ho aapke stretch marks ho aapka skin color or whatever it is that you are not confident about and if somebody tells you that wo zyada lagta hai you know like a lot of people pass judgments every single day on the way i look because that is what i do for a living everybody feels it's like an open platform for them to comment i don't feel insecure about the way i look i'm very confident about my body weight about the way i look about how i am every day is a journey towards like understanding what my body needs right now understanding myself and i work very hard on myself more than what you all see outside uh, about you know how i work towards my hospital duty and my channel and all of that more than anything i work towards myself that moment of self care that i give for myself at night when i'm just sitting with my diary and writing mujhe kaun si cheez achhi nahi lagi kisi ne mujhe kuch bola and i did not like it or you know some argument that might have happened with my family or with my friends or something that might you know have struck a hard chord in my heart and did not set well with me i will write it down and work towards that every day so every day i am working a little bit more towards myself and accepting myself as how i am so making that happen is very very important for me because if i stop working on myself 
एनी बॉडी विल हैव द राइट टू मेक मी फील एनी हाउ अबाउट माई सेल्फ लाइक फिर कल को कोई भी मेरे वेट के बारे में कॉमेंट करे तो मुझे लगने लगेगा अरे मुझे वेट लॉस करना है या कल को मुझे बोले कि स्ट्रच मार्क्स है तो मैं स्लीवलेस पहनना बंद कर दूंगी लाइक like, ऐसे ही चलता रहा तो हाउ लॉन्ग एम आई गोन कीप रेगुलेटिंग माई लाइफ एंड द वे आई लिव फॉर हाउ अदर पीपल थिंक सो यू नो आई के नॉट लिव विथ माई इनसिक्योरिटीज ऑल माई लाइफ जस्ट हिड इन डाउन देर लिटरली पीपल कॉमेंट इन हेट कॉमेंट्स ऑन माई वीडियोज इज एक्चुअली वर्क प्लेस हरासमेंट बिकॉज दिस इज माई वर्क प्लेस एवरी मॉर्निंग आई गेट अप एंड कम टू माई कॉमेंट सेक्शन टू सी वॉट माई ऑडियंस एस टू से एंड इफ यू आर हेटिंग ऑन मी और pointing out something that's wrong with me it will make me feel inferior and some day i might not want to get up and come in front of the camera because of how i feel to waisa to main kaam hi nahi kar paungi na agar main sabke comments dil se lene lagi to isliye working towards yourself is very important i would not advise you to hide your insecurities away and live with them because then any time of your life any time like it could be your in laws it could be your husband it could be your partner it could be anybody or somebody at your work or just you know random people might take that as a soft point for you and harass you with it working on yourself is the best thing you can ever do for yourself it's something that is rewardless it's not something that will pay you financially the reward is uncountable like jo sukh milta hai na after doing self care and self love and spending time with your own thoughts is the best kind of love like i cannot express to you all like that i have reached a point in life that i'm so comfortable with my own company where i don't really need somebody to be there by my side to talk to me all the time or you know just spend time with me for me to feel better about myself that external validation we look for all all humans look for it let's not make it a very big thing ke you know i'm looking for validation because i'm on the internet or somebody else is all humans want validation if you see like my mom she'll cook something and she'll ask us kaisa bana hai like it's a normal thing na she knows wo acche se bana hai unhone banaya hai hum itne saalon se unka khana kha rahe we are all okay with it and we love her food but every time she cooks she asks us kaisa bana hai she wants that validation from us ke ha bahut acha bana we all look for external validation even though we know we are amazing we'll still look for it she knows her food is amazing but she'll still look for validation from us so that's kind of something that will it's a human trait you guys you can't press that you can't change that so agar aapko aap apne mein itna confidence hona if you're so confident about your cooking your looks your everything even if that external validation is not positive it is not going to affect you so that makes me and brings me to the topic of a lot of you people's opinions about your own body or your confidence in your own body i think most of you all struggle with the way your look a lot of the comments were just about stretch marks about body fat body image issues the skin color you all have so many people even told me that you know you all don't fit into your clothes anymore so you all don't feel like dressing up you all don't feel like taking photos anymore because your skin color is a little whitish in complexion and your body image issues is a journey you guys body image perception is very individualistic like everybody matlab sabko ek alag type ka body shape idealistic lagta hai start imprinting on and start idolizing people who are very confident in their body there are so many body positive content creators online so many of you all told me that seeing instagram and watching such pretty girls on instagram it's difficult to see and that makes you all even more under confident let me tell you instagram is a lie okay instagram pe kitni sari cheeze tum tune kar sakte ho there are so many apps to you know face tune hai fir filters hai itni sari cheezon se you can just mask the way you look nobody looks like that in real life okay this is real makeup this is right now how i look no filter no color correcting no nothing this is how i look this is how my skin is and if you'll notice i'll never use filters in any one of my skin care makeup anything photos at the maximum if it's my fashion photos like my outfit of the day i will do some color correction in the vibrancy of the look but that's about it like changing up your skin texture and all of that is setting very unrealistic standards especially for younger younger audience and that is the reason that i don't do it that much because i don't want to set a wrong example for my young audience that i don't have stretch marks that i of course i have stretch marks like look at this i have so many stretch marks over here here as you keep gaining or losing weight and fluctuating in weight wo rehte hi hai guys wo kahin nahi jayenge and aapko accept karna padega apne aap ko like the way you look cuz agar nahi karoge to wo matlab there's no perfect there is no 
perfect like how long are you going to keep not wearing that dress or that swimsuit till you gain that body weight tumhare 20s 30s sab chale jayenge and swimsuit season chala jayega and you will still be working on getting that idealistic body weight to wear that swimsuit of course i also used to think like that okay i'm coming from a place ki teenage mein maine bhi ye sab bahut socha hai like i should not wear that swimsuit cuz i had thick thighs or i never wore sleeveless cuz you know i started gaining weight and it was very difficult for me to accept my weight because i was a very high like highly active person i used to dance i used to go for sports and there were so many things i used to do pehle and jab wo sab chhod diya tha 10th standard mein padhai karne ke liye tab mera bhi bahut weight gain hone laga tha like it was not easy for me to accept my body or the way i looked but eventually eventually i'm not even saying it was like an overnight thing i think kuch 10th standard mein i started gaining weight and it took me 3 to 4 years to realize and understand that i'll never go back to looking the way i did in 9th or 8th standard i am growing every day my body is changing my stretch marks are getting longer they are getting more permanent they are not going to go anywhere so how long will i not wear that swimsuit how long will i not wear that sleeveless dress you know i can't deprive myself of my joy of dressing up or my joy of you know going to a beach or i love the beach i love wearing swimsuits all my life i've been a swimmer i want to wear that swimsuit again when i started gaining weight what was majorly striking a chord with me was ki main apne aap ko waisa nahi dekh pa rahi thi it was not ki log kya bol rahe the log to bol hi rahe the and family bhi bolti hai aisa nahi hai ki you know the family is always supportive of course my parents also said ki weight gain or i diet pe chali ja एक्सरसाइज करने लग ये करने लग साथ ही साथ उनको मार्क्स के लिए भी इतने वो होते हैं कि मार्क्स कम आ रहे हैं ये कर वो कर हर चीज इंसान नहीं कर सकता है यू गाइज एंड तभी मुझे प्रायोरिटाइज करना बहुत जरूरी था टेंथ में अच्छे मार्क्स लाने थे इसलिए सब स्पोर्ट्स छोड़ दिए सब डांस वगैरह सब छोड़ दिया एंड वॉज ओनली फोकस्ड ऑन स्टडीज ऑफ कोर्स वेट गेन तो होना ही था ना इवेंचुअली टू रियलाइज दैट माई बॉडी इज मोर इंपॉर्टेंट दैन माई मार्क्स एंड माई स्टडीज एंड एवरी थिंग आई हैड टू फॉल दैट सिक लाइक आई फील सो सिक that i had to get up and start working and working on my body to realize that if i give up and neglect my health then i'll never be able to get those marks or study well or do well in my career if my health is not supporting me so i started working out and enjoying my workouts only because god gave me that literal fall he just dropped me and was like you know start again start fresh and start by concentrating on yourself start by focusing your energy on yourself so focusing your energy on yourself is the most important thing you can do that is something i think i'm going to like keep like reemphasizing to you all ke duniya ke har log tumko aake kuch bhi bole fir chahe wo aapke maa baap ho aapki family ho your siblings or your far off relatives or your friends also for that matter should not bother you if you are so strong and you're working on yourself it's going to be a journey and every day struggle to work on yourself इट्स नॉट गोना बी लाइक कि हाँ ट्वेंटी फाइव की हो गई तब मैं अपने आप को एक्सेप्ट कर लूंगी उसके बाद दुनिया को जो बोलना है बोल सकते हैं लाइक या शादी हो गई तो फिर तो ठीक है ना शादी हो गई उसके बाद आई एक्सेप्ट ऐसा नहीं होता देन यू माइट गेट प्रेगनेंट देन यूर बॉडी इमेज इश्यूज विल चेंज अबाउट वेन यू गेट प्रेगनेंट वी योर सो मेनी पीपल टॉक अबाउट पोस्टमार्टम डिप्रेशन इट्स मेजर टू डू विथ हाउ दे कैन एक्सेप्ट हाउ देर बॉडी इज लुकिंग आफ्टर लाइक आफ्टर गिविंग बर्थ यू नो सो यू विल नेवर अचीव दैट वन स्टेज इन लाइफ वे योर super perfect and you just are getting the perfect validation from outside you'll only achieve that when you are very happy with yourself like you are like no matter what na bhad mein jao main aisi dikhti hu tumko jo karna hai karo wo type ka attitude aana chahiye tumko life mein i know it looks very badass but trust me that is the way to go like right now i am gaining some weight because i'm not able to i'm working very very much and i'm not able to get any time for myself so isliye mujhe workouts ke liye time nahi mil raha hai the way i used to work out and i'm also a little unhappy with that cuz मुझे वर्कआउट करना बहुत पसंद है आई एम जस्ट वर्किंग ऑन द फैक्ट कि कब मैं अपनी वर्क लाइफ बैलेंस को वापस यू नो पहले जैसा कर पाऊंगी कि काम का वर्कलोड थोड़ा कम हो तो मैं यू नो वर्कआउट के लिए वापस जाने लगू एंड जस्ट सम लाइक सम डेज बैक समी लाइक लिटरली वॉक टप टू मी शी लिटरली पॉइंटेड टू माई फैट एंड टोल मी तेरा वेट गेन हो गया वापस वो खुश थी उस बात से 
एंड आई वॉज पता है मुझे कि मेरा वेट गेन हो गया तो मैं क्या करूँ उसका लाइक आई एम वर्किंग टूवर्ड्स माई सेल्फ एवरी डे ना एवरी डे आई ट्राई कि हाँ मैं वर्कआउट के लिए उठती हूँ नहीं हुआ उठने तो अब मैं क्या करूँ मैं वापस हो जाती हूँ एवरी डे इज एन एफर्ट एंड यू नो फ्रॉम वेर शी वॉज कमिंग आई नो एज अ पर्सन शी इज वेरी इनसिक्योर ऑफ हो वेट सो शी इज ट्राइंग टू प्रोजेक्ट हर इनसिक्योरिटीज ऑन मी बाई मेकिंग मी रियलाइज दैट आई हैव गेन्ड वेट सो पीपल एक्चुअली कम फ्रॉम अ पोजिशन ऑफ प्रोजेक्टिंग दियर इनसिक्योरिटीज एंड सिंस आई वॉज सो सिक्योर अबाउट माई वेट गेन एंड आई नो फॉर अ फैक्ट कि हाँ मैंने वेट गेन किया है तो क्या हुआ मैं कम कर लूंगी मेरी बॉडी है मुझे जब वर्कआउट करना है जब मैं हेल्दी खाने लगूंगी वो वापस कम होने लगेगा वेट इट्स अ वेरी फ्लक्चुएटिंग थिंग यू नो बॉडी फैट आता है जाता है रहता है नहीं रहता है तो उस वजह से मैं दुखी होके नहीं बैठ सकती या उसने जो बोला उससे ऑफेंस नहीं लगा सकती आई जस्ट मूव डॉन आई हाँ ठीक है हो जाएगा सो वॉट एंड शी लिटरली हैड नथिंग एल्स उसे क्या बोलती वो बिकॉज शी वॉज लाइक इसने तो एक्सेप्ट कर लिया अपने आप को अब मैं क्या ही बोलूँ दे कांट दे कांट ट्रिगर यू इफ यू आर नॉट गोन गेट इजिली ट्रिगर्ड रिमेंबर दैट लाइक इफ यू आर सो कॉन्फिडेंट विथ योर सेल्फ यू विल नेवर गेट ट्रिगर्ड एंड वेन इट कम्स टू योर स्किन कॉम्प्लेक्शन एंड द वे यू लुक trust me everybody on instagram also looks like that maybe one day you'll have that kind of body and not have the time to go to the beach itna kaam hoga na tumko ki beach pe jaane ya chutti lene ke liye time nahi hoga to kya karoge like what will you do when will you take that photo just because your complexion you're going to wait till your complexion lightens and you become fairer sitting at home doing all those home remedies and then once again you'll go out in the sun and become tan this is literally a vicious cycle you're getting stuck in looking for validation outside and waiting to get there you're never going to get there perfectly you'll always have something holding you back and trust me the key to happiness is realizing that life is one and it's temporary and you got to start living it one day at a time and not really caring much for what others have to say of you because everybody's opinion does not matter even sometimes your family's opinion does not matter the next topic around that surrounds that if there's negativity around you how do you take that there is a negative environment because abhi covid ki wajah se you can't even run away from home you know sometimes your family is only so toxic that you want to run away from home but you can't and that is a fact you guys family can also get toxic only i know we all see only the good side of life we only see the uh pure and the love and all of that on social media sometimes even that can get toxic the toxic positivity is also a thing okay it's like you see other people's family be so perfect and you feel like why isn't your own like that even that kind of affects your confidence and start you start ruminating over those thoughts and it starts bothering you i think in that case where you can't just run away from your family or you don't even have your own room to run away or escape to the best way to escape to is in a notebook it's in a diary where you just write and pen down your thoughts i've always said this to every one of my friend as well ki writing really helps me when there are times of course that i also don't get along with every single person i come and have in my life and you cannot just get rid of people from your life you know that's not always the solution so if they are bringing you down if they are affecting your confidence if they are affecting your way of life and being toxic to your way of life you start just writing down and finding solutions yourself trust me when you just start writing your problems every day in a diary na just unfiltered unthought of just write in anger be it in frustration be it in crying like i have written diaries while crying and have tears in my eyes and just written 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 you will start finding solutions in those words itself you'll start finding solutions by yourself you'll not have to look for solutions outside you'll not need somebody to come and tell you ke aage kya karna hai you'll not need somebody to come and guide you and you will not need positivity around you all the time because your positivity will lie within you and having negative thoughts is completely okay it's not like you know that toxic positivity we see online ki only think best and only think good and good vibes only and all of that great i also believe that good vibes only all the time but yes negative thoughts are normal they come to you they haunt you and they will bother you and working towards them and writing them down and trying to find solutions is healthier than saying ki nahi aani nahi chahiye negative thoughts waisa nahi hota somebody specifically asked me that i'm sensitive and outgoing so people take my emotions for granted this is something that is so personal to me i think this happens to me a lot because i am very extrovert very outgoing and people think just because of that i'm very thick skinned also which i am i've become very resilient to what my environment is and how people think of me and perceive me 
बट बहुत बार लाइक समटाइम्स इवन माई मॉम से एज दिस टू और समबड़ी शीज कंसोलिंग और समथिंग लाइक सी सारा उसको कोई चीज़ का फर्क ही नहीं पड़ता है उसको कुछ भी बोल दो उसको फर्क ही नहीं पड़ता है ऐसा नहीं है कि उसको फर्क नहीं पड़ता है ऑफकोर्स सारा को फर्क पड़ता है बट सारा बताएगी नहीं कि उसको फर्क पड़ता है आई थिंक इज समबड़ी इज लाइक मी हु इज वेरी रेजिलियंट कैन रिलेट टू दिस के we show that we are thick skinned and we show we are outgoing but of course everything hurts us also it's just that i choose not to show that i am hurt by you because i don't want to give you that power and make you feel like yeah your words hurt me and i'll rather cry later on and feel bad later on i'll cry or ever build a bridge and move on than cry in front of you and make a scene over there and be like kick you why did you say this why did you say this because it hurt me just you know sometimes those confrontations if you can avoid them altogether now they are for the best because that confrontational situation just leads to more hurt because nobody wants to accept they are wrong these days nobody wants to accept that they have made a mistake that they have said something to hurt you they will just feel ke ha usko to koi cheez ka bura nahi lagta na usko kuch bhi bol do usko kya farak padta like from my teenage to i think up to now like i'm 22 i have grown so much from being a people people pleaser to being a self pleaser and letting people be like ke ye main hu तुमको जमता है तो रहो नहीं जमता है तो प्लीज लीव लाइक दिस इज नाउ माई एटीट्यूड लाइक बिकॉज आई कैन नॉट चेंज फॉर एवरी वन इवन इन अ फैमिली ऑफ फोर एवरी वन विल हैव अ डिफरेंट परसेप्शन ऑफ यू डिफरेंट अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ यू एंड डिफरेंट एक्सपेक्टेशन फ्रॉम यू एंड यू कैन नॉट मीट एवरी वन एक्सपेक्टेशन आई रादर मीट माई ओन एक्सपेक्टेशन एंड बी लाइक के दिस इज हाउ आई एम इज इट वाइबिंग विद यू और exit doors right here okay i'm going to set my face using the pack micro finish makeup fixer this is like the lightweight base makeup that i would do uh like literally what i've been doing these days just a light layer of foundation yes i've mixed two but both of them were very medium sheer coverage and just light like even for powder i did not cake up powder i just dusted some residual powder from my brush so very dewy and very lightweight and i love loading up on fixing mist and once i've done that then i take my highlighter and i will just use my highlight on my cheekbones sorry <laughs> collar bones cheekbones pe to laga chuki hu and over here All right, I'm filling my brows in first. I'm using the mini so eyebrow pencil. While I fill in my brows, the next uh, self-confidence hindering topic to a lot of y'all, your insecurity was when it comes to speaking in public, like speaking up for yourself or social anxiety disorder. कि नए लोगों से बात नहीं होती है या फिर interviews में कैसे बात करें. Communication issues are big time there. And of course, this is something I think school से inculcate हो जाता है. If you've been that shy, timid. cannot make conversations with people in college kind of person then i think you have to start your growth from scratch you know starting by first talking to yourself in the mirror just giving yourself pep talks you know again this self confidence and being in love with yourself comes into the picture just look at yourself in the mirror when you're in the bathroom when you're having a bath look at yourself pamper yourself talk to yourself you know give yourself that motivational pep talk every day if that's what it takes do it every day i do it so many times like sometimes i'm just having a bath एंड नॉट इवन लिसनिंग टू म्यूजिक जस्ट टॉकिंग टू माई सेल्फ हमको फोन की इतनी आदत हो गई है ना कि बाथरूम में भी फोन ले जाना है एंड हर जगह तुमको फोन रहता है तुम दूसरों को ही देख रहे हो पूरा टाइम सोशल मीडिया पे पहले कभी खुद के साथ टाइम स्पेंड करो लाइक स्पेंड टाइम विथ योर सेल्फ द डेज आई एम वेरी एग्जॉस्टेड एंड द डेज आई रियली नीड अ पेप टॉक आई डोंट टेक माई फोन विथ मी इन द बाथरूम आई रादर टॉक टू माई सेल्फ इन द बाथरूम एंड give myself a pep talk and no matter how weird that is it works like a charm trust me just talking to yourself ki ha aaj ye hua aaj ye problem thi aaj maine iske sath aise deal kiya aaj mujhe ye karna chahiye tha ye bolna chahiye tha to maybe i would have done better next time i'll do this you know just give yourself that pep talk so just doing that trust me it like these small small practices na tumko pata bhi nahi chalega when you are working so hard on yourself it will be such a breeze na it will just come naturally to you then that con friends and communication will just come naturally to you like you'll be in a social situation and be like completely comfortable with everyone around you so it's always a journey but this is how you start working on it watching a lot of videos on you know motivation self help self love and not just watching all this time pass entertainment ye sab type ke video bhi dekha karo isliye i try to make my makeup videos only more conversational so that we are having real talks over here and not just talking about makeup as much as i love talking about makeup Let's talk real as well. Going to keep the eye look very simple. Taking this Elf Matte for Matte Palette because we are doing a red lip. So, halka sa kuch eye shadow pe I'll do and we'll call it a day. Also, if you're not confident in your interviews and you don't uh, speak English very fluently, if your first language English is not, 
and you want to learn to speak in English fluently, reading helps a lot. Like as a kid, I used to read a lot of books, lot of books. That's why my hold on English is very good because I only used to read novels. Tabi phone ka zamana to thai nahi to phone samar pas thai nahi. The only form of entertainment was reading books and watching that one or two TV show at night. And watch a lot of English movies, English shows. अभी Netflix तो सभी के पास होता है. Start like you know adding subtitles and watching everything. So that will also help you gain a stronger command on your English. So it's never too late to learn and make conversations in those language that encourage people कि मुझे English में बात करो. Like when I'm talking to Chotu also, I will talk to him in English and he will respond back in Hindi. तो वैसे उसको भी English समझने लगता है. अभी starting में तो उसको Hindi भी नहीं आती थी बराबर. So he used to talk in his own mother tongue. And हम उसकी भाषा समझते थे तो even with the language barrier we set a form of communication and today he can understand English talk in Hindi fluently and know his mother tongue so you see the growth he is having over here so just like that you can grow too you can learn any language at any age there is no boundary to your learning and no boundary to your growth. Star of the show, the red lip we were all waiting for, and since I want to do an old red lip, my signature used to be the Wet and Wild. I'm gonna top this up with Estee Lauder's Decisive Poppy. Alright, you guys. So this completes this very fresh makeup look that I've done for this summers and everything that I want to talk to you all about my journey from vulnerability and insecurity to self confidence. It's like I said, a journey, and it's not like I've achieved my destination. Every day I work towards myself. Every day I remind myself of a lot of things that helps me get through each and every day and the struggles of each and every day. I hope this video helps you all and you all remember that every single day that passes is like a stepping stone to loving yourself better. And to working on yourself, and never stop working on yourself, you guys. You are always your biggest prized possession. Remember that nobody is like you. You're literally one unique person in the universe. So nobody can be like you. You have to make yourself that unique and love yourself for everything that you have. And stop looking at social media and feel like you have to reach there for a destination. You have no set destination. Your journey. Just start enjoying that. And trust me, you love your life just as is. I hope this video helps you. in some sort of way if you liked it then don't forget to give it a big thumbs up so it just helps the algorithm and helps a lot more people because youtube has become a little nasty when it comes to notifications so don't forget to hit the like button so that it helps reach a lot of people and also share this video with your friends family and people you think will benefit from this conversation or just in general that you want them to have a like minded conversation with you always keep positive people around you but even if you have negativity you can grow through it as well remember that you can grow even in a negative environment don't let that pull you down i know there were a lot of questions about career and financial independence as well which i've not touched upon in today's video i try to do these q and a's on instagram every month where we do a separate career q and a so if you want to be a part of that you can follow me on instagram or we could do this separately like completely a different video for financial independence career and you know how i have achieved financial independence at 22 and what i do and all of that for today's video the sara squad shout out goes to prajakta b Thank you so much for watching and supporting my channel. If you want to be a part of next video, Sarah Squad shout out. You know what to do. Hit the subscribe button, bell icon right next to it, and also leave a comment down below saying hashtag Sarah Squad. And you get a chance to be a part of my next video, Sarah Squad shout out. I will see you guys very soon in another video. Bye, guys. Love you. Mwah.